Well, Boogie, what the hell are you doing in my room? I need my diaper changed. Well, that's not my responsibility. Now get out so I can practice my karate. <laughs> My daddy said you're supposed to be in here doing your homework, not practicing karate. Yeah, well, my teacher said I don't have to do homework because I'm eight years old and I'm the man of the classroom. Tom, won't stop lying and come change my diaper. No, well, Boogie, now get off my cat and get off my bed. This is my horse. Meow. Well, Boogie, get the hell out of my room. I don't want to have to use my weevil karate skills on you. <laughs> I'll leave as soon as you change my diaper. No, well, Boogie, ask mom or your dad. I'm not gonna ask them. They're watching their TV show. Then go ask grandma. No, she has to change her own diaper. I'm about to scream, and then mom's gonna come running in here, and you're gonna get in trouble. I'm about to count down from five before I take this diaper off and unleash the rest of this liquefied excrement all over your bed. Five, seven. That's not even nine, how you count down from five. Two. Okay, diaper's coming off. Well, Boogie, no! Me, yeah. I. It's the La Boogie Show. If you mess with a dad, then you gotta go. It's the La Boogie Show. She gon' get what she wants if you ain't know, now you know. Pineapple at the bottom of the ocean floor. What the hell is this? Flip the channel. Don't, first of all, who do you think you're talking to? Secondly, La Boogie is sleeping and you better not wake her up. I will, we don't care if she wakes up. Plus, she's not even watching this. I want to watch my show. Man, please, you know she likes watching SpongeBob as she sleeps. All right, just let her take her nap and then ask me again in like an hour. Anything you tell me to do, I don't have to listen because you're not my real dad. Plus, your breath smells like the owls of a... Did she wake up? That was close, but I wasn't even scared. Tyrone, I need to go make a phone call. I need you to watch the boogie. Hell no, minutes. she's not my responsibility. That's not my I baby. I don't want any talk back, okay? Watch her for a couple minutes. If you don't change her channel, I'll let you put on your show when I come back. Fine, I'll do it, but she's not my responsibility. She's your baby. I'll be right back. There's no way I'm keeping this on. He must think I'm stupid. It was just my weekend look. Daddy say you better not change my channel. First of all, well, Boogie, I'm way older than you, so I don't have to listen to you. Plus, I'm the man of the house. You better change this channel back to what I was watching. No! Tyrone, I'm going to tell you right now, I promise you don't want these problems. Well, Boogie, leave me alone. I'm trying to watch my show. You got to the count of five to change the channel back, and I don't know how to count, so I'm just going to start with the number five. Well, Boogie, stop talking. All right, I'm going to slap you so hard, my dad's going to feel it. Well, Boogie, leave me alone and go back to sweep. All right, fine, I tried to warn you. You brought this pain upon yourself. Ouch! Oh, 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 am I bleeding? Oh, yeah, hi, I'm, I'm still here. Ouch, well, Boogie, that hurt. We're not allowed to hit. I don't care. I tried to warn you. Now, where's my horse? He's not a horse. He's a cow. Meow. I don't care what you call him. He's my horse. <laughs> Meow. Now you change my channel one more time. I'm going to dangle you over the balcony by your ankle. No, you won't, well, Boogie, because I'm stronger than you. Plus, I'll tell your dad. Okay, thanks. Great talking to you. Bye. Oh, great. She woke up. <laughs> and Tyrone, why are you crying? I hurt my wag. Your what? My wag. I hurt my wag. Your wag? You mean your leg? Yes, that's what I just said. Okay, how did you hurt your leg? Well, Boogie was dangling me over the balcony and then she dropped me. <laughs> okay. All right, you're, you're, you're joking, you're joking. That, that's funny, Tyrone. No, I love that you're a good big brother to LaBoogie. You're telling a story, and that's good for her. You're going to help build her imagination. I love that you guys are getting along. Thank you.